think one night stands are great. They um, they prepare you for um, what is it like? It's like the pregame show. Mm -hmm. It's like before you start playing in the real world. One night stands, you know, it prepares you for sex and it increases your skill set. Why am I sounding like a coach right now? <laughs> <laughs> Well, it could be a positive experience and a negative experience, depending on the situation that you're in. Uh, it could be negative because you're basically risking something. You don't know the person, you don't know what they're standing for. Mm -hmm. uh, if you're being safe or they're being safe, you, you never really don't know you're getting into a situation. You're going to enjoy it for the moment being, mm -hmm. but then it might be something that you might regret in the future. You don't know what's going to come out of it. Um, when I stand, um, good question. It could be a good thing, it could be a bad thing. You're obviously taking a risk. As long as you play it safe, I think there's nothing really wrong with um, being able to have fun and enjoy. Again, as long as you're cautious of who you're sleeping around with, then you don't see anything wrong with it. I don't know. I mean, free love started when birth control started. I mean, mm -hmm. you know, condoms, birth control pills. And it's just an expression of who you are. It's like a like a fashion sense. If you mm -hmm. feel that you have to you know, dress a certain way to portray yourself or just have a free loving mentality, then that's just who you are. I think a uh, one night stands can be okay. It's just as long as it's. If it's not a like an everyday thing, if you have it once in a while, it's a good it's expressing yourself. But I think everyone still needs to have a relationship every once in a while. But the one night stand is not a problem really.